this video we will study about the rivers cities and the geographical wonders of north america continent for better understanding please watch complete video and keep at last and outline map of north america continent and locate with me friends sit like a rock work like a clock knowledge and success is in your hand first we learn rivers north america continent is the third largest continent in world it has thousands of rivers but in this video we learn important rivers in north america continent first one is the yukon river this is yukon river yukon river source is a atlan lake british columbia canada it runs 3190 km before it ends in bering sea it is the third longest river in north america continent it flows in canada and the state alaska of usa second one is mackenzie river this is mackenzie river mackenzie river source is the lake great salt it flows towards north and drains in the arctic ocean mackenzie river is the longest river in canada and the longest river flowing into arctic ocean from north america continent third one is the nelson river this is nelson river this is lake winnipeg this is hudson bay within hudson bay another one small bay name called james bay nelson river source is a lake winnipeg it flows towards north and drains in hudson bay next one is st lawrence river this is st lawrence river this is gulf of st lawrence this is north atlantic ocean in 1534 french explorer jacques cartier was the first european who discovered gulf of st lawrence and its shores of st lawrence river here comes five lakes in this five lakes this is lake ontario lake ontario is source of st lawrence river st lawrence river connects all five great lakes or homes or laurentine lakes with the atlantic ocean here this is the border between canada and usa next one is the mississippi river this is mississippi river here comes yellowstone national park in this national park there is a lake name called lake itasca lake itasca is source of mississippi river mississippi river is the second longest river in usa and north america it flows towards south and drains in gulf of mexico it has 3730 km it has two tributaries first one is the missouri river and second one is ohio river next river is the missouri river this is missouri river missouri river source is the rocky mountains it flows towards south and joins the mississippi river in a city name called st louis it is the longest river in usa and north america it has 3767 km length seventh one is the colorado river this is colorado river colorado river source is rocky mountains it flows towards south and drains in gulf of california this river form 39 km border between usa and mexico next one is rio grande river 
This is Rio Grande River. Rio Grande River's source is also Rocky Mountains. It flows towards south and drains in the Gulf of Mexico. It flows in the USA and Mexico. Here, this is the border between the USA and Mexico. Ninth one is the Hudson River. This is Hudson River. Hudson River source is a lake tier of the clouds in Adirondack Mountains. It flows towards south and uh, drains in the Atlantic Ocean through New York Bay. Next one is uh, Columbia River. This is Columbia River. Columbia River source is Rocky Mountains. It flows towards south and uh, drains in the Pacific Ocean. It flows in uh, Canada and USA. Now let us learn cities. First we learn cities in Canada. Canada is also known as uh, land of lilies, land of maple and the great white north. In this country, first city is uh, Yellow Knife. This is Yellow Knife. Yellow Knife is in the banks of uh, Lake Great Salve. Next one is uh, Winnipeg. Winnipeg is in the banks of uh, Lake Winnipeg. Next one is uh, Toronto. Toronto is in the banks of uh, Lake Erie. Fourth one is uh, Montreal. Montreal is known as a city of magnificent distance. This city is an island city. This island is formed by St. Lawrence River. September 16th, 1987 was the important day in world history because Montreal Protocol means Montreal Environmental Agreement signed in this city. So, September 16th, we celebrated as World Ozone Day. Fifth one is Quebec. This is Quebec. Quebec is in the banks of St. Lawrence River. Quebec is one of the industrial city in Canada. Sixth one is Ottawa. Ottawa is capital city of Canada. Next one is uh, St. John's. This is St. John's. It is capital of uh, Newfoundland. Newfoundland is famous for fishery. Next one is uh, Vancouver. This is Vancouver city. This is Vancouver Island. Here comes Strait of Juan de Fuca. This strait separates Vancouver city from Vancouver Island. This city is uh, important in uh, Western Canada. Now let us learn cities in USA or land of free. First one is uh, Duluth. Duluth is in the banks of uh, Lake Superior. Lake Superior is the largest sweet water lake in the world. Duluth is also known as Weed Atta Center of the world. Next two important cities are Chicago and Milwaukee. This is Chicago, this is Milwaukee. These two cities are in the banks of Lake Michigan. Lake Michigan is completely in USA. Milwaukee to Chicago, the area between these two cities is known as Tool Belt. This is Chicago. Chicago is also known as Windy City or Hambucher or Tool Maker and Stalker of Wheat. Next one is Detroit. This is Detroit. Detroit is in the banks of Lake Erie. This city is known as Mota City. Now let us learn cities in the eastern coast. First one is Boston. This is Boston. Boston is a historical city in the eastern coast of USA. 
1773 Boston Tea Party was held. What is Boston Tea Party? Please comment in comment box. Next one is New York. This is New York. New York is in the banks of Hudson River. New York is a commercial and financial capital of USA. In this city, New York Stock Exchange or the Big Board is situated. 24th October 1945 was the important day in world history because the UNO was established. Its headquarter is in New York. Next one is uh, Philadelphia. This is Philadelphia. Philadelphia is one of the historical city in USA because uh, American constitution signed here. Next one is uh, Washington DC. This is Washington DC. Washington DC is capital of USA. In this city there are two sub organs of UNO. First one is IMF means International Monetary Fund and IBRD means International Bank of Reconstruction and Development. Next one is uh, New Orleans. This is New Orleans. New Orleans is in the mouth of uh, Mississippi River. Now let us learn cities in the western coast. First one is uh, San Diego. This is San Diego. Next one is uh, Los Angeles. This is Los Angeles. Los Angeles is known as uh, Hollywood City. Next one is uh, San Francisco. This is San Francisco. San Francisco is known as uh, City of Golden Gate or uh, Silicon City or Silicon Valley. Next one is uh, Portland. This is Portland. Portland is in the mouth of uh, Columbia River. Next one is uh, Honolulu. This is Honolulu. Honolulu is capital of Hawaii Islands. It is also one of the important city in USA. Now let us learn city in Mexico. This is Mexico City. Here comes Mexico City. Mexico City is one and only important city in Mexico. Next one is Havana. Here comes Havana. It is capital of Cuba. Cuba is known as the Pearl of Antilles and the Sugar Bowl of the World. Now let us learn geographical wonders in the North America continent. First one is Grand Canyon. Grand Canyon is carved by Colorado River in Arizona provinces. It has a 446 km length, 4 to 29 km wide and 6093 feet depth. Next one is a Death Valley. Death Valley is a desert valley in Eastern California. It is one of the hottest places in the world. Next one is a Niagara Fall. Niagara Fall is in between Canada and USA. Here comes five lakes. In these five lakes, uh, this is Lake Erie, this is Lake Ontario. This is Lake Erie. This is Lake Ontario. These two lakes are connected by Niagara River. This Niagara River made this wonder. Please visit once in your life. Next one is Yellowstone National Park. This national park is the first national park in the world. This national park is known for its wildlife and its geothermal features. Especially like Old Faithful Geyser. Jim Carbet is first national park in India. Next one is a Redwood National Park. In Redwood National Park, there are redwood trees. Redwood trees are the tallest and huge trees in the world. Hyperion is the highest tree in the world. It has 300 
79.1 feet height. It is in the Redwood National Park. Next one is a Pradesh. Temperate grassland in North America continent is called Pradesh. Prairie grassland is in the interior of North America continent. This is extended from Canada to Mexico. Here, wheat and maize are the main crops. This grassland is known as wheat basket of the world because it produces a large amount of wheat. American bison or the American buffalo is iconic animal in this grassland. This is a national mammal of USA. This is a Yukon River Valley. In this valley, there is a valley of 10,000 smokes. This is Hawaii Islands. In this island, there are many active volcanoes. Active volcanoes and a valley of 10,000 smokes is a geographical wonder of North America continent. These are all important tourist places in North America. In this video, we learnt rivers, cities and geographical wonders of North America continent. Please like, share and subscribe my channel.